Hi guys, welcome back to Home Reviews Hub and today I'm going to be reviewing this water drop lucid water filter jug. Uh, it's 3.5 litre jug and what it does is it reduces the fluoride, chlorine and many more impurities in your water. It's NSF certified, BPA free and this is a blue colour. It also comes in a darker blue, a black, a white and also in a 2.4 litre if you want a smaller one. I'm just going to unpack the jug and it's a decent size jug as well so you won't have to just keep refilling it every two minutes as I had to do with my old one which was smaller. This is a contact us card as well so feel free to contact us and it's got a phone number and an email on there if you have any problems and you need some support. It's a, a US phone number uh, that, that's there and then it's got some tips and tricks about how to best use a jug, how to activate the filter and if the if water rate goes slow what you need to do or look out for and this is the owner's manual so as always it comes with a instruction booklet I'm just going to unpack the jug and I got the lighter blue colour I actually got two, one to put on my table and one to put on by my kettle the dimensions of the jug are 10.0 by 5.3 by 10.0 inches just make sure that it fits in your fridge door because I do, as I said, do a smaller one that might be more suitable if you're using it directly for the fridge that's the filter light so every time you change your filter you need to reset the light and inside it you've got one filter that comes with it as well and it says the filter can filter more than 200 gallons or 757 litres of water before it needs to be replaced so pop the inner jug in and making sure the two line up and then you need to pop the filter in into the slot that's in the inner jug and then put the lid on top of it and you'll hear a little click and that's all fit securely it's not going to fall off now before you use a filter, what you need to do is you need to soak it to activate it. So you need to soak it in tap water for about 10 minutes to activate the actual filter. If you do get stuck, everything is in the information booklet and it shows you exactly what you need to do and how long you need to soak the filter for. So just refer back to the information booklet if you do get stuck. I'm off to soak my filter, so I'll see you back in a while. The filter's finished soaking and I've cleaned the picture as well. So now I'm going to fill the picture up with some tap water. And you can see it's got two little holes at the bottom where the filtered water then flows through. And it takes about two, two fillings to fill the jug up. And it's saying that it's complete filtration in one minute. So it's got fast flow rate. Filtering one funnel of water only needs about one minute. So we can enjoy our water quicker. And you basically need to repeat this twice. So fill it once it's filled empty it and then fill it again I've overfilled it here now once that's done what you need to do is you need to activate the filter life indicator so you hold down the button for three seconds and you wait for the blue light to flash and that activates the indicator which then monitors the state the filter status as you pull the water out again everything's in the instruction booklet if you do get stuck or you're just not sure how to do it so just refer back to the instruction booklet and it's also got some technical specifications there as well, such as filter capacity, the weight, size, the flow rate, and also the temperature of the water. And it's got this really cool feature where it's got an automatic water inlet. So you just open the tap and the little slot at the top just automatically goes down. And then when you finish, just turn off the tap and it just goes back up again. And we're going to do that again. So it's just really easy to refill your jug when you need to. So thanks for watching Home Reviews Hub. The link is in the description below and I'll see you on the next video. Thanks guys and see you next time. Bye.